objective. To determine the amount of dissolved oxygen in the given water sample using standard N by 40 sodium thiosulfate solution. Apparatus required Burette, pipette, stoppered flask, beaker, funnel, and stand. Chemicals required N by 40 sodium thiosulfate solution, manganese sulfate solution, alkaline iodide azide, concentrated sulfuric acid, potassium iodide solution, freshly prepared starch solution. Theory The experiment is based on the oxidation of potassium iodide by dissolved oxygen. The liberated iodine is titrated against a standard sodium thiosulfate solution using starch as indicator. Since oxygen dissolved in water remains present in molecular state, it is not capable of reacting with potassium iodide. An oxygen carrier such as manganese hydroxide is therefore used to bring about the reaction. Manganese hydroxide is produced in situ by the action of potassium hydroxide and manganese sulfate. Procedure Rinse the burette with the standard sodium thiosulfate solution and fill it up with same solution up to the zero mark. Take 50 ml of water sample in a stoppered flask, avoiding as far as possible contact with air. Immediately add 1 ml of manganese sulfate solution and 1 ml of alkaline iodide azide in the flask. Insert the stopper and shake it several times. Allow the precipitate to settle halfway and mix again. Repeat this process of shaking and settling at least three times. Add 1 ml of concentrated sulfuric acid and insert the stopper and shake it again. Allow the dark brown solution to stand for 5 minutes. Titrate it against the standard N by 40 sodium thiosulfate solution till the color of the solution becomes faint yellow. At this stage, add few drops of star solution. The color changes to deep blue. Continue the titration till the solution becomes colorless. Record the volume of hypo used. Calculation Calculation is based on law of equivalence i.e. N1V1 is equal to N2V2. Result Report the concentration of dissolved oxygen in the given water sample in ppm.